as you know, having the DJI Osmo Mobile has been a headache if you have an iPhone 7 or 7 Plus. So the issue is the OIS and the iPhone 7 and 7 Plus. The OIS and the Osmo Mobile compete with each other, but there may be a remedy that was sitting in front of our face the entire time if you have an iPhone 7 Plus. And as you know, the iPhone 7 Plus has a dual lens system. One lens being the 12 megapixel EyeSight camera and the other lens being the 12 megapixel telephoto camera. Now the EyeSight camera does have OIS, but the telephoto does not. So if we shoot our footage in telephoto on the DJI Osmo Mobile, that eliminates the OIS, giving the gimbal priority and we should get stable footage. So what we're gonna do now, here's the test. First up, one time zoom, eyesight camera, here we go. And yes, the jello, the warping, the tugging is there. Now, for the moment of truth, 12 megapixel, telephoto lens, no OIS, two time zoom, here it is. I think this is better when it comes to the wobble, but is it as crispy? Now I'm actually even gonna go low and actually use this Osmo Mobile like never before with my phone. Check this out. Uh oh. So let's do a side by side comparison. Now you can see for yourself. On the left, we have the one times OIS. On the right, we have the two times no OIS. Here is the footage. This is the part where you make your screen big so you can see it clearly. Okay, so now you know that if you have an iPhone 7 Plus, you should use the telephoto lens if you don't want that warping or jello effect with your image from the OIS problem. But if you have an iPhone 7, I really can't help you. So if you like this video, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. If you love this video, make sure you subscribe to see more. I'm Ken from The Modern Reporter, and I hope to see you again soon, just not as wiggly.